This video will show you how to install Dynamic Auto Painter 7 on Mac. Although Dynamic Auto Painter is a Windows application, there are several ways to install it on Mac. While we recommend using commercial applications such as Parallels or VM Fusion, it is also possible to use the free wineskin. Downloading the already prepared wine environment for version 6 is the simplest way to install version 7. Download the DMG file for version 6 from the links provided. It is a big file. It will take some time. Now open the DMG file. Copy the DAP6 icon to the Applications folder. If you copy the file to Applications and then try to run it on a recent Mac OS, it may display a message indicating that it is damaged. Of course, the app is not damaged. It is the operating system that prevents you from running applications that were not downloaded from the App Store. Control, click the undamaged command script in the DMG file and select open from the menu to remove this message and allow the application to run. It is a simple script that removes the copied application's extended file attributes. If you want to know what the command does, right-click it and select open with text edit. Now if you go to the applications and run DAP6, it should open. Close it down. Download the Windows version 7. We are going to install it in this version 6 environment. Go to the Applications, right-click on the DAP6, and select Show Package Content. You will see application called Wineskin. Run it. Click on Install Software. Choose the Setup Executable and navigate to your downloads. Select version 7 you just downloaded. You will go through the installation process exactly as if you were on a Windows machine. Disable Launch Dynamic Auto Painter 7 for now. Go to Advanced. We need to set the executable file to the new one. Click Browse, navigate to Drive C, Program Files, DAPRO 7, and select DAW Painter EXE file. You can change the name to DAP7 as well. Now close it and go back to your Applications folder. Rename the DAP6 to DAP7. Now run it. You should have version 7 running on your Mac. The user folders will be created in your documents. This is where Dynamic Auto Painter stores its user data. Follow this guide if you want to install any future updates. Of course, you no longer need to go to Advanced to change the executable file, as it will be already changed to version 7.